going to try to explain a problem I have. As you can see here, I have input to roughly 50 and 39 watts. I'm going to close off one of them. Because this is a little bit easier to explain. Look, I have one source in 40 watt. It still gives me a couple of amps out of the battery. If we look at an external meter, you can see that we are getting amps to it. So this is where it gets tricky. Because if we look at the panel, it clearly says where all the power and everything goes. And that's fine. But the problem is when we close down and we don't have any power incoming at all. As you can see it says zero amp charging now. Zero incoming. And that's fine. And the battery is on standby so if I shut down the grid it will start to pull the power from the battery. Sorry. But it draws over two amps from the battery. Why is it using battery power? I mean, why? It's a zero here. It shouldn't use the battery unless I configure it to use the battery. So if I disconnect the battery instead, look, zero amps. The inverter works fine and everything. So why is it using the battery when it shouldn't? If I hook up one of the PV arrays again, you will see that it immediately stops using the battery and actually starts pumping in battery. And that's because the AC is charging a little bit. Is the internal metering wrong in this unit? Because to me it looks like it doesn't meter the amperage going to the battery properly. And this is a problem for me because it's draining my batteries during the night. And now in the winter time in Sweden we don't have much sun at all. So I have a big issue actually having the batteries topped up. Please, can you answer that? That would be really fine because I have big issues here. So thank you, bye.